What's up guys and girls, Jesse Daly here. Welcome back to Daily Weather, my friends. Do we have some tropical trouble heading uh, towards parts of the Caribbean? Well, it's possible. AccuWeather seems to think there is a low chance of this happening uh, around May 22nd-ish. So what's going on? Well, basically, according to this uh, article on AccuWeather um, and also some of the forecast models, which I will show you in a minute, uh, there is something that looks like it could develop a, a potential storm um, that could develop uh, near Central America and then move toward Jamaica. Now, look, this is really early. I don't want to like freak anybody out. This this channel is not um, one of those like hype channels at all. I just want to give you the information that I'm seeing so that you can then um, you know do the best you can to be prepared and safe because hurricane season is is right around the corner. So in uh, the month of May, something that can happen. Uh, I'll just read it to you here. Around the middle of May, a large, slow spinning area in the atmosphere could develop somewhere around Central America, overlapping with part of the Caribbean and Eastern Pacific Ocean. This phenomenon, known as the Central American uh, Gyra, can sometimes lay the groundwork for a tropical depression or storm to take shape. This is a, uh, a graphic from AccuWeather showing the this uh, Central American gyre. It, it, it's a an area that will, you know, spin and uh, an area uh, in the atmosphere that um, can potentially help to um, spin up a, a system. And typically what happens this time of year, uh, if something does develop, it would move toward the northeast, which would take this, you know, around, this is um, Jamaica here, taking it over this way and then out um, up to sea. Historically, this can happen in May. Um, I'm over here in the um, the Virgin Islands, which is why I'm sitting outside, by the way, pretty nice today, day today. Um, but we're not in this um, potential zone right now for May. Doesn't mean it can't happen, right? But this area can uh, spin up some systems. Um, and I want to show you also, well, actually one last thing. Um, you know, during mid-May, we do get a lot of rain throughout uh, Central America. Actually, over, we've had, had a lot of rain over here, Puerto Rico, Virgin Islands as well. Um, but this is that general area that I was just showing you where, you know, clus thunderstorm clusters can, can form and then potentially develop into something. This is the um, global forecast system, courtesy of tropicaltidbits.com. This is uh, May 22nd here. This is the area we were just looking at. So this, the GFS, global forecast system, does show something uh, potentially developing here. And then, again, kind of taking it across. This is May 23rd, taking it across um, Jamaica area. And that's where this particular forecast model stops. Again, this is like super early, my friends. So we really don't know what's going to happen right now. Um, there's a low chance, as again, AccuWeather says, low chance of development. But I thought I would show you this just because I want to bring you, um, you know, what I see. I will be here in the Caribbean throughout hurricane season. Fingers are crossed that it won't be too crazy. Um, but I will make sure to... Um, you know, bring you the latest. And until we meet again, stay safe, hit that subscribe button. And as always, I will keep an eye on the tropical skies come rain or shine.